I am here at the Maritime Aquarium in Norwalk and it is so exciting because we have a new exhibit to unveil, A Slug's Life. I'm here with Dave from the Maritime Aquarium. Tell us a little bit about this beautiful and very unique exhibit. It is unique for the Maritime Aquarium because, you know, rather than just live animals, it incorporates all sorts of beautiful photography and sculpture about these really interesting little creatures called nudibranchs, which are a type of sea slug. And they have some um, issues. The, the way that the ocean climate is changing, that uh, they become somewhat vulnerable to ocean warming, ocean acidification. So by using these uh, pictures, the beautiful photographs and portraits, and also these sculptures by a sculptor from New Haven named Gar Waterman, we get people to slow down and say, wait, what are these little creatures? Rather than just looking in a tank and maybe not seeing them right away and moving on to the sea turtles and the sharks and things like that. So we want to slow them down. And these beautiful sculptures and photography help do that. I was going to say, because it's not very often that you see sculptures mixed with these living creatures, and especially, I mean, these sculptures are beautiful. And speaking with uh, the artist earlier, he tells me, you're not going to find something like this anywhere else. I, he, I believe he will build himself as the world's only stone sea slug sculptor. So, and to, and to what he does is to take these beautiful little, uh, sort of squishy little soft animals and create them out of a very solid piece of marble, but to have them, uh, have them capture the way that they look in real life out of such an unforgiving medium. It's very interesting and creative. Certainly something to put on your CT bucket list, and you guys are always coming up with new exhibits, so I'm sure we'll be back here again soon, Dave. Hope so. All right, for now, that's the latest in Norwalk. I'm Margot Farrell, Fox 61 News.